The search for a missing woman in Seminole County comes to a tragic end. The remains of Nancy Davis have been found after she went missing at the end of February. News 9's Brittany Tulis is live in Seminole with what investigators know. Brittany. Yes, Sylvia, officials say Nancy slid off of the icy roads after dropping off her husband's medicine while he was at work. She then called to tell him he was stuck and was going to walk home, then disappeared. But she was trying to walk home and she couldn't make it up the hill because of ice. Um, that was at 10.40 p.m. We didn't get notified till 4.30 a.m. Almost a month passing with investigators and volunteers looking for Nancy Davis. They began searching on this rural road in February after finding a pill bottle with her name on it. Dark, very cold that night, so freezing conditions. We don't know was her, what her mind was going through. Did she get disoriented? Police say they don't know why it took so long to call them with the dire conditions that night. Saturday morning, they continued the search at Wawoka Creek, finding a purse and pocketbook that weren't there before. We think an animal actually separated them two and drug the big purse out, and that's why now we could see it on the drone. Mm -hmm. We walked about 400 feet to the east down the creek, and we did find a body that was half in the creek and half out of the creek. Now investigators have to find out how she ended up in such a remote area. And it's about a quarter of a mile from the road to the creek. And so um, her health problems that she is having and some of her walking ability, how she was able to walk that far in the, in the ice. And investigators say the remains are too decomposed to determine a cause of death right now. The medical examiner were due with that. And officials would also like to thank all of the groups and individual volunteers that dedicated hours to searching for Nancy. In Seminole, Brittany Tulis, Oklahoma's own News 9.